This is, uh, as you say, a really well-known school in South London, and uh, this whole street, uh, anyone who's familiar with this will know it's quite a long road leading up to the school. It's full of fire engines and ambulances and some police cars as well. So it is uh, a still a hive of activity going on here, even though the fire has, has been put out. It's, it was under control about an hour ago, and it's now out. But there is still a lot of activity here and lots of emergency services vehicles uh, still here. Lots of people, as you can see, walking around uh, and residents uh, very, you know, understandably concerned about what might have happened. And as you say, a 16 year old boy, we know, has been arrested on suspicion of arson. Uh, that news from the Metropolitan Police just uh, in the last few minutes. Um, this fire, we understand, started around 10 o'clock this morning. Uh, it's a four-storey building here. The atrium apparently is where the fire was. It's, it's been burnt. Uh, nearby shopping centres and some local residents had to be evacuated from their homes because, of course, the school might be empty, but the local area, there are still uh, people around. London Ambulance Service have said that no injuries here. They hadn't, didn't need to treat anyone. Um, uh, initially, there were concerns that anyone might, uh, might still be in the school. But uh, in and around this area, local residents are being urged to keep their windows closed. And that is because there is still a real thick smell of smoke around. It's just walking up the street, you can smell it as soon as you get here. And the Metropolitan Police, as, as I say in the last few minutes, just confirming um, that... A 16-year-old boy has been arrested on suspicion of arson and he, uh, he's been taken into custody. And they also say that the nearby shopping centre and some residential addresses have uh, been evacuated as a, as a precaution. And the, this road, this entire road, Seagrave Road, is still closed and people are being asked to avoid uh, entering this road or coming into this area.